I'm Ruth, a patent holding inventor and maker. And I'm Sean, a designer and engineer. And we believe that kids have the best invention ideas. So join us on our mission to build kids' ideas, make mistakes, and show that anyone can be an inventor. Kids invent stuff. Now we love robots on this channel, but a lot of high tech robots are kind of missing something. They don't have enough flair, glitter, or pizzazz for our liking. So we decided to host the world's first robot pageant. And to kick things off and inspire our robot pageanters, we decided to bring to life seven-year-old Abra's lollipop dispensing robot. Let's build this. For this project, we teamed up with the amazing folks at XRP, who created this incredible simple robot kit that can be assembled really easily. And because the kit is so simple, we set out to create a brass lolly dispensing robot using as simple materials as possible, starting with a delightful robot body made from the finest cardboard. And then we found these adorable lolly dispensers that we sprayed along with the robot body and mounted them on the robot itself, along with a speaker and some servo motors to pull the lolly dispenser triggers and dispense lollies. So a bra wanted their robot to say, have a lolly when it dispensed a lolly. Um, so I've got this online robot voice generator and I've asked it to say hello have a lolly and we're going to record it onto this little soundboard here so that when a lolly is dispensed it will activate and it should hopefully say this little phrase hello have a lolly with our robot ready to unveil to some kids we then went on a road trip to Warrington we are going to Warrington to meet loads of kids who are going to be building robots today to compete in the world's first robot pageant and I'm excited, Ruth's excited, Emily's excited, you can't see Emily, and Holly Park the robot is also excited. She's got a little teeth. <laughs> so our team's assembled, had a play around with the kit. And then learned how to build the base of their own robot. Hello, have a lolly. Hello, have a lolly. Running. I'm just slightly worried because you took a lolly. I need a lolly. Hello, have 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 a Hello, 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 and with Lolly successfully dispensed and some busy weeks of robot building from our robot pageanters, the day had finally come for the world's first robot pageant. Our teams assembled, did some last minute tweaking of our robots, practiced their talents and their presentations, as well as having a little play with some other robots that were around. Just look at these beauties. We had dancing robots, we had jam spreading robots, and even a robot that helped stop littering. As well as showcasing their amazing talents, the robots took part in a red carpet catwalk. And after the fun and the glamour, it was time for some prizes. From school's workshops to Gulliver's theme park tickets, the worthy winners of the world's first robot pageant collected their prizes. What a day. So this has been the story of how we hosted the world's first robot pageant and we want to say a massive thank you to the amazing folks at XRP and UTC Warrington for helping us make it happen. And we also want to say a massive thank you to our amazing robot pageanters and of course to Abra for their incredible lollipop dispensing robot idea. 
And if you know of any kids who might like their invention ideas brought to life, then you can send them to our website, which will appear on the screen below. And you never know, we might be bringing to life your invention idea very, very soon. We will see you next time.